was right. I knew it. You were right. Absolutely. I was right. Yeah. I knew my stuff. Yeah, it would be kind of hard for Gibbous to, to punish that. Gibbous, yeah, uh, Greninja Jab comes out on frame three. Yeah. So. Man, Kurgan, wow, shout out okay. to Kurgan and Hammer. Shout outs to Winner's Finals happening right now with Ados and Jason starting off on Smashville. Oh. And he was stuck in his shield because of that beautiful shine. Jason got the free grab. That almost, that true block. So him. who played who? Did Ados play Jason? Or did Ados play in or did Jason play in? I'm pretty sure Ados played in and it was off stream. Oh, I'm sad. Which is unfor. Okay, I know Ados was saying before the stream, or they, before we they started did that without the tournament. Telling us. Which is upsetting. But yeah. like I remember Ados saying that he hates the Ryu Ditto right before the tournament today, and he wins, wins a Ryu Ditto. He's, he's constantly been struggling with the concept of it. I know that at one point he went cloud for it. He doesn't hate it because he's not good at it. He hates it because it's boring. He thinks it's boring. I mean, really? I feel like it's exciting. Exciting for a viewer. But Boring because a there's player. a constant tension, but for you, it's constant walking back and forth and not committing to anything. Okay, makes. I feel like that's most of those though. Yeah. Anyway, uh, while we were talking about that, Ados managed to get that focus. Ooh, and Jason answering back real quick. Even game, zero percent on everybody. Now this is one of Fox's, this is debatably Fox's worst matchup. Uh, it's between yeah. this and Bayo. A lot of, A lot of Foxes talk back and forth about it. Because so Uptilt little... destroys Fox. Yeah, perfect and... percent. Oh my gosh, it's the perfect way and fall speed, jeez. Yeah. It destroys Fox, he kills Fox super early. Yeah, super light. Mm -hmm. And uh, he does a lot of damage. Now Fox can beat up a Ryu, absolutely. But if he doesn't kill the Ryu, and there's a lot of times where he just is able to escape the Fox kill setups, like, oh, man. It, it can be hard. And he's heavy. He's yeah. super heavy. Look how high he's living right now. Not getting punished there. Finally landing the second up smash he needs to get that second stock off. But man, that I was still a very scary situation for Jason, even at those percents. Mm -hmm. yeah. Bump, bump. I'm really surprised I knew just that the yeah. down tilt was off the top nine. of your head. Yeah, right. That I was, was just impressive. like, I was like nine frames. So I was like, yeah, nine or nineteen. So I guess I was like, I don't know where the nineteen. That was a came big from. range. <laughs> but I was just like nine. Boom. Maybe I'm just like a, an accidental frame god, and I didn't even know it. Oh. So Jason didn't want to go back and like challenge that because there's no landing. Yeah, here. honestly, at that pers uh, like with the how he had already positioned himself on the other side of the stage, there's no reason. He wasn't at a position to go for up airs. Oh, and at that percent, he wouldn't be able to like confirm much else off of it. So much quick percent. Round 20 more, and Jason's dead. Honestly, the more he hits Ados, the more he puts himself closer to death. All of those jabs, the, the reason those were so slow is because jab, you can hit confirm into uppy, but he did it a little bit uh, too slow or the, the game did not register. Oh, what he was oh my running. gosh, catching him there and taking away all that momentum Ados was trying to build up. And now. It's really unfortunate because jab, jab short you can might have killed it from the position he was in. Yeah, oh, I like the, the innovation with the combos there from Ados. Unfortunately, he Tatsu's at the ledge there when he wanted to run off back air to try to punish Jason. All right. Uh, that's Gets two two opportunities that Autos might have taken a stop now. Yeah. So, super unfortunate. Probably thinking about that in the back of his mind. Now, still has Jason over on this Whoa, ledge. Oh, Jason, what are you doing? Yeah. Jason. Autos there confused as well. <laughs> Didn't go, not going for a punish. I actually asked thought about this. This is funny. Jason's yeah. the person you want to win, and Autos is the person I want to win. I love Jason. And they're battling in winner's finals. Yep. This is pretty great. But, um, okay, yeah. it is so risky what Jason's doing right now, going for these auto cancel down airs to try to set stuff up. The reward is wow, huge. But from the across risk, the stage. Trying to just go in with down airs at kill percent against a Ryu, you're gonna die. That he has so many anti airs, but now oh the risk gosh. is gone. So, you know, what's even more insane about that is that Alice was only at 20%, yeah. and he forward tilted him from across the stage, and he died. Yeah. That's just, that's insane. Jason was just at such a high percent, and Ryu is the king of anti airs. Gosh. I don't think I'm going to get over that that kill. Now, off the stage, once again, we didn't see too much netted when Jason was pinned over here on this left corner earlier. And look, just gets right out, gets right over to controlling the game. Oh my gosh, what a recovery from Atos there. That right? was insane. Stalling with the with the focus? And wow. it didn't even matter, but still, wow. It's a great innovation there to keep himself living a bit longer. Uh, we do do best of fives now in our grand finals and winter finals, so. Yes. 
I mean, that was uh, an impressive swing in momentum. Yeah, all right. But let's see if um, Isles can swing it back in his favor. Two, down two games currently in this winner's final set. Going right back to Smashville. Let's see what he can bring to the table. Um, what I what I really noticed in those last couple games is he really struggled with getting this damage and tilling these stocks, especially when he has Jason trapped over here on one of the ledges. I want to see him capitalize a bit more. I want to see him oh, find opportunities. Oh no! Unfortunately for Jason, doesn't get the full drag down there, and Atlas is going to be living a bit longer here. Okay, did not want to be messing around on that platform. I don't blame him. Finds his way down and catches Atos on his way down to set up a lot of damage, and the juggle continues. Dash attack leading into up air upsets me. I, the, the fact that Fox can just, like, continuously... Like, one dash attack gives Fox so much. Like, why not dash attack there? That's, that's, that's a good option. That's, that's crazy. It's great for catching landings. It sets up for so much. You just get up air after up air after up air. Once you get trapped in the air with Fox up air, you're done. And then back air, too, for spacing, auto canceling itself. Man, it's. Fox, Fox has, has a lot of tools. He has very, very good aerials that set up a lot. Atos now, you know, on the receiving end of almost every single aerial from Fox and his first stock. What can he really do to bring this back? Low percents on Jason. He's getting to these higher percents where that. um that is going to be killing, but we're in the same position we saw in the first stock. In the last game, Jason with a huge lead, Atos in the air on the receiving end of aerials. Nice, catches him with the up tilt before he's able to make it to the ledge. Goes for the fake trump, but Atos doesn't bite. Yeah, Otto's giving a little fake there himself, allowing Jason to think he could go for a punish and then hitting him with that Shoryu. Now, caught on the reds, that's, yeah, I was about to say, you do not want to be in that spot. Jason's momentum after, like, the second stock in game two was insane. Yeah, he had, he just, he smelled blood. Yes. He, he was like a shark in the water. Uh, he was ready. He was playing a little bit more patient in the game three, where once he got a hit, it was a lot, but he was not willing to get close enough to get up tilted to get anything. But yeah, he, exactly. he was staying very far away, enough where he, like, if Otto's got a little bit too uncomfortably close, he could like allusion to the other side. Yeah, right. Like he he was not afraid of being trapped or being damaged uh, in those corners. And oh, thank you. Uh, there was a lot of pressure yeah. where uh, he had Otto's on the platform, and there's not much that he could do about like auto cancel back airs and uh, the up air pressure. Yeah, uh, really. Like, and that's what a lot of uh, what Jason's been doing all night, right? Just he's his shield pressure, and this is. Like his aerial pressure, his pressure in general has just been really, really on good. point tonight. 